think we need a chemistry lab. Oh, okay. Jack, Kras, I can we place the latoite actually on the smelter? Maybe a good idea? Well, Please. I just asked, where do you want me to place it? Well, a common sense would suggest on the smeltery. Well, I don't know how it works. I'm new well, to this. You've played uh, like two hours of this already. Jack, yeah, that a, doesn't mean I'm an expert. Just a, whale just a whale suggestion here. Like, is maybe the lag maybe to do with all the machinery around one area? No, what you'll find is comedy because everyone's off doing their own thing. That's why we're trying to stick together a bit. Uh, I'm here. That's why we're trying to stick together a bit from now on. Uh, well, why don't we just use one of my spare trailers then? So I've got I'm two about, to, I'm about to make another one. So if you take uh, the seat off there, then Castle can travel with you or if you want to drive up to him. Or you yeah. can take Danger Man himself. <laughs> Danger Man. Here's a spare rover seat just in case. Oh, I think this may actually need a rover seat in the buggy. We were going we to call you Danger Moose, but then we couldn't call you a rat bastard. <laughs> Thanks, I just leave it on there Oh damn, uh, this buggy looks actually uh, quite intense all of a sudden. Let's have a look at this. Oh my god. It's C and V to rotate, by the way, Jack. Just just in case. Bastard. <laughs> How dare you be helpful, you prick! Okay, well, what am I doing? Can I have a buggy? Uh, you can have a tractor if you want. Oh. No. And... You need to find a, uh, put a small generator on it. I have a small battery. Oh, we'll put that on it then. I see, I did need like a power generation thing on there. You can have two things, so I can have a battery. Oh, also, I built your trailer as well. It's in the box on the printer. Do we have any carbon? Uh, oh. There is a small bit on one of the medium generators. It's near the soil centrifuge. Ah. I was actually going to take the <laughs> medium generator with us. <laughs> Sneaky snake. <laughs> Guys are touching me up with a cable over it. By the looks of it, it required, um, it had some connection port to, like, it's a tractor and stuff, so I'm just trying to grab a generator just in case. Right. Here you go, Kraz, I'll put some storage on the back for you. Thank you. Oh, okay. That's it, I'd recommend putting a generator on the front just so you've got, like, a power generation option. Wait, wait, wait. Can oh, I fall into the Kraz hole. I have a better idea. <laughs> what if I grab this spare medium generator? Can you fit that? No, don't put it on the back. That's gonna. You, uh, why not? Because you you want cargo capacity, I do, don't you? Well, I mean, we'll make another one. Make another what? Thingy. Because I have a medium generator. You know what we've spoken about? What is the thingy's called? I think he's meaning another trailer. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I mean, if you want to make another one, knock yourself out. But you can require two aluminium for it. I think we have some down here. Come on, he's. Come on, Jack. You're from the UK. You you're, should be well versed in the thingy. Yeah. Well, when it comes to Kraz, it's kind of you know. Great, right. uh, Jack. If you want to come over to where you're set up here. Oh, we found another oxygen filter. The robot still feels so glitchy. <laughs> oh. There's your Mako. Yeah. Oh, you haven't seen it until you've seen the um. Oh, was it was playing yesterday. The um Star Citizen again. We was driving around my Ursa Rover. That is literally the Mako from Star Citizen. It was all fun and it was all fun and games until High Tech fired a missile into my face as I was driving a rover and I also got like jetted back fifty thousand <laughs> meters a second. Right, are we all mounting up then? Yep, okay. What is this thing? Where am I going off to? Uh, yeah, you're, with me. you're getting on board. Right, so, hold up, what is this? Oh wait, hold on. Ooh, that works. And Kraz meant to be getting uh, on board this chapter. <laughs> you alright? The chills just don't need work properly, mate. Hey, we need oh. some carbon. Why do we need carbon? Just to put this big generator. For the generator that he ignored us that we don't need No, 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 I put it on the, our main thing because it's still a wind turbine. My legs inside this little Why sea kind of look like... Why do you need carbon? Ladles. Kras, come on, we're waiting to go. Okay, fine. Hurry up, you Swedish prick! No, you. You Irish bastard. Get on the tractor! Oh. Shut up, Jack, you're Welsh. What? Get off my lawn. Where are you? Over here. Where we've been for the last two minutes. Why did we get him that? Bye, friendly Dwayne. Thanks, Kraz. You've already <laughs> just cut me up. 
literally <laughs> five seconds in the journey he's always being an asshole driver cut yeah. me off i think you mean cut me off just like he fucking flies to your buggy with a knife yeah. why didn't we mine all this over here <laughs> because we probably missed it right what we can do is we're gonna go to a ramp and we're gonna time it perfectly so we jump up and land on the next planet <laughs> how the hell do we get oxygen by the way the keep it oh did they just create it yeah yes well, Another little scary. expedition we're going on. Oh, was, <laughs> both of us went into a tree. That's not very scientific. Someone wasn't looking where they were going. Uh, <laughs> Morning. Oh, Jack just crashed into the macaroni farm. <laughs> oh no, we're stuck. It's fine. We'll oh, get you it. haven't oh. Austin Powers, that have you? No, I. <laughs> we're not showing that stars in the stream again. Who who completely shagged what? Um, I Austin powered the hover bike, the rover, and the ship about three times last night. Next time, can we have I mean, someone near this fucking forest out? I mean, I flung it into, um... Well, Finn flung the hover bike oh! down a pit and died. Yep. I flung it into the hole at left you. Come on, <laughs> Finn. Oh, there's a traffic jam here. Come on, mate. to see you do any better, Chris. Well, I'm waiting. Jack! <laughs> you bitch! Well, you need to remember, Finn, like, Chris isn't as bad as people say. He's actually so much fucking worse. <laughs> I just un unplugged this trailer. I'll pit shit karma struck. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what you're you fucking I... See, I just I'm got... It's hard to pronounce. I just got through without a fucking issue. Ah, there's my beacon. Where? If I knew I was taking this Bakara's voyage, oh, I would have you know, built a hovercraft. Uh, there's a beacon there. Woo! <laughs> let's, let's love the little voyage we're all going on at the minute. This is why I love this game, because you can just do moments like, oh <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> I seen you doing a uh, wheelie though. A little bit of weekend out there. Oh no! Generally. <laughs> 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 yeah, I remember that video of Jeremy Clarkson and Reliant Robin. That's basically me right now. <laughs> oh, I see the beacon. Peter Stringfellow's going to come out of nowhere and give me a lift. Wait up! Eh. Where are you make, going? Make it, make it, make it, make it! Nailed it. Woo. What the hell is this? What's what? Oh, it's this shit. That's the castle. Up. Yeah, hold on. Oh, god damn, that's cool. Jesus. Yeah. That's, um, <laughs> ominous. Um, yes. not gonna lie, it's giving me some minor Steven Universe vibes here. Mm. I'm getting very um, Mass Effect y slash No Man's Sky feels. Oh, no, it's just like the only time we get the Mass Effect Actually, vibe is I'm like. Actually, I'm getting um... quite a large Mass Effect Andromeda vibe from this, to be honest. <laughs> is that a good thing or a bad thing? Um, well, as long as the faces aren't around it, we should be good. No, like, uh, I was gonna say, the only time it would give you the Mass Effect vibe is if you've seen like that Profine. <laughs> Uh, flashback from the first game. Oh yeah, every time you touch an artifact. What? It just all the stuff just. We could have just got off. And... Uh, no, there's little um connector clamps here. Oh. Is that why you bought the generator? Yes. Because I wonder if it requires. Oh. Well, it did a thing. Huh? We need, we need crabs to come over here. I am here. Look! Look at this. Oh, was... there's three of them. I was so, just getting some compound. We need to power all three. I've got a battery and a ge small generator. Uh, can I just take the small generator over? Does it, when you place it down, will it generate, uh, give it a little drop point? I hope so. Uh, no. However... Well, or do we just it? separate the trailers? Yeah, if, yeah. We if we use Kraz as one and then separate the other trailer, like, leave the trailer of a generator oh. currently parked on it. Uh, that one's not powered anymore. Yeah, but you can turn that on. Something oh. just happened. Let's turn that generator off a minute. Yeah, and yeah. Wait no, until right. we'll wait until we've got them all plugged in, and then we can go for it. Like right, that one's plugged in. Let's plug Hello, I'll get this one. And I'll I'm, I'm, plug I'm plugged in. I'll Ooh. flick this generator on. Uh, Finn, could you reverse a bit? Oh, yeah. There we go. Oh. Um. Right. Plug that in. There we there go. go. Um. Uh, would you like to do the honors? No, oh, that one's already on. Never mind. Back up, okay. I suggest. Back up from the center. This will have just activated a bomb. 
<laughs> it's just all of us go flying. <laughs> Kills the entire planet. Okay, move it. Well done, everyone. Thanks for tuning in. Um, oh my god, the uh, there's a tiny, out. There's a tiny effect if you look up. Oh, oh I see that. Like a wormhole effect. Uh, someone's generator thing failed. Ah, oh, the buggy. Oh. Uh, not the buggy, the... Uh... Oh, right. Tractor up here. See, I should, I, we should have oh, brought wait, the, the medium generator with us. Yeah, I'll let you off on that one. We should have. Damn. Uh... Oh, there's a solar we... panel over there. Which is, we're now in dark. That's always a good idea, Jack. Well done. I mean, we've got two windmills with us. I mean, I'm going to have to power this, though. I have a battery, a windmill, and a generator. Um. Okay, well, the rovers have got power in them, right? What? Yeah. Our issue is the medium generator over here. We need... Let's take the medium generator off a minute. Come put the solar panels or the batteries on this other rover pad. Okay. And we might be able to power things from here. The question is if my wind... What about the buggy? There's no way we can use that, is there? No, the buggy doesn't have a power source. Damn. It doesn't have a lead you can, like, you know... Oh, right, it's empty. What? I unplugged it for the minute. Wait, there's stuff over here. Maybe we can grab something. I was going to say, like... No, we need to use a furnace to turn organics into co uh, coal, don't we? Carbon, you mean? Carbon, yeah. You know what? Ow! You alright? You, know, you stepped on one of those plants, didn't you? Oh, there's a small battery here. Okay, let's take that with us, mate. And there's a solar panel. Medium solar panel. Ah, for God's sake! You just did the same thing. <laughs> <I did> the... <sighs> Two of a kind. Pen and twice. <laughs> Would you not? I'm trying to save us here. Oh, what an ass. <laughs> fuck you, fuck you. I was like digging your way up there, don't worry. Right, so what we should do... Yes. Is take that off. That's a brilliant idea. We use solar panel power in, uh, darkness. But what? Hey, it's <laughs> fine. We mm. just need to wait until uh, it's daytime. Hi, right, everyone set up camp. Aye, aye. <laughs> I can't stop. <laughs> yeah, we need like the Hawaiian music every time that happens. <laughs> it's like dancing on ice, but dancing on artifacts. Where the fuck am I going? I don't know. Oh no. I'm not gonna make it. What's happened? Are oh, you over there? I'm on my way. Drive, come on. Oh, not. I'm. I'm the rover's having. Did you just nick my windmill? No! <laughs> I, I did it. I don't know who did it. fuck? <laughs> now Finn died. What is wrong uh, with this car? What happened with the windmill? It doesn't want to work. It doesn't. Is it a. It isn't on there. Yeah, I, right, well, I know the windmill's not on here, you prick. I mean, the car won't work. Well, where the fuck. Oh, you have it on you. Good news is, I can bring some stuff over from the base. Bring yeah, bring in, like a generator or two. Uh, when wind turbines are here, um, bring carbon, carbon and wind turbine. I would like to make a suggestion to Editor Jack. Yeah. In that moment of Finn's desperate plight, where he needed assistance, and Jack bravely jump into the buggy to come oh, assist him. Oh fuck off! I want some, I want some triumphant music that uh, starts Jack's off really Jack's powerful and then just slowly deflates to the sound of and just like ends on a horn going. Why is there a body over here? Is it Me. Fence? That there's was another. A... There, no, no, no. There's another body. That oh, was is that one, of, is one of the mountains now? That was a that. lovely attempt uh, to Jack, but you fucked it. <laughs> it just warped through the ground. It did, I just saw Kraz blow that up. It just it just warped through the ground. Yeah, you can't do, dig as fast here, now, can you? Oh, it looks like it had a stick of dynamite. Now I'm sad. Oh, shit. Is he, is he oh, I'm also realizing my buggy was over there. Yeah. I mean, my buggy's glitched at the minute. Or oh, sorry, my tractor at least. For some reason, um, whenever I try and drive it, it just sticks to the ground. Come on, come on. Just gonna that. <laughs> Which, I can't, I'm really sad I couldn't loot that backpack now. Do you want to come try and drive my buggy, if possible, please? Sure. As it's um, it's, it's acting weird for me. 
So it works fine for you, but as soon as I get into it, it glitches out. Uh, how do you activate the solar panel? Because... It's, it was automatically active. Right, hop out of it. Right. It's, it's not getting any sunlight then. Yeah, like I said, I didn't think solar power would work in there. Cheers, guys. Working again there. Well, if we pull it off a little bit. I beg your pardon? Yeah, like, exactly like that. Yeah. I cleared every bit of the mountain and it's suddenly getting some light in. I say we move it all up. I, honestly, I think it's fine there just now. It's powering just now, so... Yeah, but it isn't powering enough. It's... Yes, it's powering enough. The thing's activated. I'm glad. What well, I already look forward to is everyone in the comments is going to tell us how this artifact works, and that we probably can't access it just yet. Uh, by the looks of it, we need we need to be able to generate enough power. To, as the well, no shit, Sherlock. No, no, no like, we need about five amps of power. And how much is that in generators and windmills and batteries? Oh, right, well, the solar generator seems to be powering the thing enough. And I reckon that once Finn gets here, we'll actually have enough energy to launch this as long as it happens throughout the day. The solar generator is not even active. It fucking deactivated the second I stopped. You <laughs> solar power prick! I'm almost out of power. Uh. Oh, I see him. He's so someone drive the rover out to him. Oh no, own. I'm in, I'm in a rover. Oh okay. Do you build an entirely new one? Yeah. yeah that right. way I could have carried some stuff over. Uh, where's the buggy, Jack? Oh, it's just parked on the side. Don't worry, he's here now. All right, good, good, good. I stole the buggy's generator. <laughs> <laughs> Finn just appeared with a tractor with a giant whisk. <laughs> I brought a windmill. There we go. Right, plug them all in. I Ooh, made sure they all look. had. The windmill doesn't. Can work again. Have you got um carbon, Finn? I do have carbon. Come plug this into the generator. It's not the windmill. Turn them all on. Right. Okay. Turn everything on. Which no, what are you doing? Oh, okay. The thing. Okay, good, good, good. God, man, good. he's over so much. Unlimited power. We need to check this bug over here. Quickly, use the windmill. It's there. <laughs> he just fucking chucks it. No, Chris, not that windmill. The big one. Well, put it on. Well, I'm over here. You're closer to it. Oh, you can't. No, no, no. Leave it on. Leave it on. I have organics oh, for on me. Fuck's sakes. Oh, oh hey! my. Hey! See, if you let me plan next time, it will oh. be fine. Oh, my. Wait, wait, wait. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. Well, you're already touching it. Oh, okay. I thought someone else could do it. Okay, right. The choice is surface elevation 2, surface elevation 6, uh, interior elevation, and surface elevation 3. Pick one before I click it. I feel interior. I have no clue what the fuck we're talking about. I'm just sort of looking at this thing, but I'm getting no prompts. Yeah. Oh. It doesn't. Oh. Uh, it didn't want to work out well. What are we doing? I don't know. Finn's. I, I just need the artifacts to open. I think this is a map of the planet. I think the top one is the one we've just activated, Jack. Hang and on. then like. Yes. So me... therefore. That would allow yes, because that's what people are saying. They're telling us there's something at the core of the planet. They said oh, we should need to go so... down there and investigate it. So I'm guessing you unlock all of these, and eventually that allows you to teleport around the planet or something. Okay, so we've activated one. We've got another five to activate then. And something at the core. So we need to. So what you're saying is, there. us digging straight down is actually a good so what idea. You're Not is, yet. From what I'm looking at, there's some kind of just... Star Trek out there. If I had to take a guess here, I'm going to assume that the middle section is like a sealed chamber of sorts, and it won't unlock until all six um, of these are activated. Anyone also, else? Holy shit, the Hexrons are in this place now. Yeah, I was just about to point that out. <laughs> Sorry, Finn. Are we trapped here forever? Well, I think that's a good point to end today's episode on, because we've made some really good progress. You know, we've managed to unlock this artifact as well, which I'm sure everyone in the comments is probably going to tell us how we should actually use. So, uh, I think we're going to make some progress on towards the, uh, next location which can be quite fun Good everyone enjoyed today is... yeah yeah <laughs> there was that kerfuffle just trying to get this thing powered up well you know what we got there eventually it's like a bunch of amish trying to survive a digital apocalypse thank you everyone for tuning into this version of astronaut it's been quite funny and thank you to all your helpful tips in the comments so far 
Uh, I'm looking forward to tuning back in for some extra episodes, to be honest, as I think this will be quite cool. Remember to leave a like rating if you are enjoying the series, that tells you are, and uh, we will see you next time. Goodbye. <laughs>